Okay, I hope all of you are doing great. There's many more and more customers asking for the higher capacity prismatic lap pill for sales, such like if MB56 or also have clients call it EVELF, how to say, 56K, yes, and um, for the capacity of 560 MRs, we'll have some clients also asking for if MB31 or MB30 for the bigger capacity. But indeed, um, those batteries still very harder for purchasing this year, and also including the MB31, uh, we'll have long time shortage. And uh, for this big demand, we're also trying to find the similar batteries to meet the demand. The markets, our clients, the demand for more power of the solar home so projects. Okay, and today I want to introduce, introduce two models. This one is Kettle. 314 mRs and this one is Goshen. Goshen 314 mRs. They are same model but a different manufacturer. Okay, Catel is uh, the top one manufacturer for the battery as all you know. And Goshen also is very popular in the battery market. Uh, this one is Catel and you can see the QR code. They can just uh, verify. And then this is the normal welded M6 stars. Um, they also have little different like this terminals, yes, they have just a small different like the color, yes, also have different. And this is fireproof, also got different. And the color code, this is for Goshen, this is for Catil. And the, uh, but the size are similar, but actually same. Um, I think if you have been used Catil, you should know the Catil says inside, uh, if you're shaking, you can closely, you can hear some water, yes. But other brands, like this one, if you're shaking, actually no, no oils, no oils. Um, the market also called those batteries can loading, fully loading. After fully discharge, they can loading around 340 amp hours. Um, I don't know if they are truly can reach that high capacity, so let's just test them. So today I will just test two of them of the uh, one cycle of fully charge and discharge to test out the fully loading capacity. Uh, I will test, first I will test the cattle 314 amp hours. I still use the tester, dvc 40 l Yes, I'm just testing. Testing current is 40 amps. Yes. Just connect. So red wire connect with the color tip and uh, between the big wire and the small wires just with some space, don't touch together. And we'll have some difference for the testing results. Yeah, just have some space, yeah, don't touch, touch because of, if you touch them, the metal was always the inter internal resistance to influence the testing capacity results. Yeah. And uh, I would use the tester connect with the PC. To set in. This is much easier for me. First, after connection, you can see this USB adapter connect with the PC or computer or laptop with the tester. After power on, uh, the tester screen will show the voltage. This voltage is our normal nominal shipping voltage. Oh, this is okay. Now let's connect, then can set in the uh, testing steps. First, uh, I discharge with constant current 40 amps to the end cut of discharge and 2.5 voltage and then start. Okay, the tester working and the computer also shows the testing curve. This testing will take around uh, 10 hours at this bigger SD. So uh, let's wait. We will test the cattle, then test the Gaussian. What are same steps? Test from discharge to 2.5, then charge them back to 3.6 voltage and uh, show you about the testing of real capacity. Let's see if they can reach to 340 mRs or not. Let's see, it's unbelievable. This battery really can reach to 340 amp hours. So this one is Goshen model, 340 amp hour. And the Goshen, yeah, you can see the Goshen, here have some difference. And the buckle is here. Okay, I'll also show the PC testing curve is stable. And uh, same, uh, it's not 100% finished, but it's uh, I think just a few minutes. Then we'll face finish this testing. 
It's good news, great news. This battery can reach to 340. Today is 2025, March 27. And uh, it's taking about two days. Test out two batteries, compare cattails, so it won four MR, and go stream, so it won four. Okay, hello. Hello again. This is, I just tested for one more time about cattail. 340 MR battery cells. And then weightage is around 3.6 and cut up to 2.5 and uh, with constant discharge current 40 amps. This is the time. It's uh, March 29. Yep. I tested it last night. And still, the capacity test out is not reached to that Goshen 3014 type Kyler. This one only 327 MR after fully loading the capacity. Yeah, I also can have a look of the tester. Ah, oh, hi. <clears throat> yes, this cat is always together for my work. Yeah. No, 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 no. Yep. Um. So I take around the three days, starting from March twenty seventh for testing Goshen three hundred fourteen and the Cattail three hundred fourteen. They are same size but different manufacturer, mm, same model, but the loading capacity is different. Goshen tested out is three. 140 hours. A cattle tested out is 327. <clears throat> okay. Thank you guys. Any questions, you risk? <coughs> Thank you, everyone. Any questions, welcome to contact me with Facebook, YouTube, website, or email. I will be happy to service for you. Yes. Bye bye. <coughs> bye bye.